Time to find some amphibians. Rainy season. Got the big girl with me. Had to give a shout out to her. Don't want to leave her hanging. Perfect time to come find some amphibians. So let's see what's hiding under some of these logs. You can see, look, this is the perfect habitat. Wet logs. And look what I just found. California new. Very poisonous animal. Out here walking about. Just saw him walking in this log, minding his business. I just found California newt number two. Very poisonous amphibian. Here's what you call the Incitina yellow-eyed salamander, or yellow-eyed Incitina salamander, the perpetrator of the California newt. He looks just like the California newt, but he's not highly deadly toxic like the California newt. Other animals would think that this is a California newt because of his color, because they know the orange means very poisonous. But he's basically still in the identity of the California new. So other animals won't bother him. It's a defense mechanism that they picked up. But this is the Isatina salamander. The way you can tell the difference is the California newt has rough skin, and the salamander has smooth skin, almost kind of slimy a little bit. And their skin is kind of translucent, almost clear. And they have more orange on the arms and legs. California newt is mostly orange, just on the underside. So that's the difference. They both amphibians, closely related. One is, but the California newt is a newt, and this is a salamander. Two different species. All right, I found Incitina salamander number two. It's a different one. Just looked under this log and found one. Just chilling. The perpetrator of the California newt. Look at his eyes. Look very, very similar to the California newt and the rough skin newt, but this is a salamander. Yellow-eyed Incitina salamander. Man, check out these Tarzan vines. Straight out of the jungle book. <laughs> Look. If there were people swinging from vines, these would definitely be them. Tarzan vines. Walked up on the coyote. I knew I was gonna see one today. It's watching us because I'm in this territory. We're watching each other. He's watching me and I'm watching him. I'm trying to lure my dog in. It's most likely another pack on the other side waiting on him. And they lured him, him in to lure my dog. See the signs? He's marking his territory. I'm trying to get my dog to come. They're letting off smells. I got these out here smart. I just saw another coyote right there peeking through the edge of the forest waiting to see what, if my dog was going to chase that one. As soon as the coyote saw me looking at him, he darted off back in the forest. So they plotting on my dog. Mushroom going out of cow dung. The coyote led me to some magic mushrooms. They turned blue, y'all. They definitely turned purple and blue. When I did the mushroom test. So they're edible. Yeah, it's growing right out of cow shit. What you think it is? Are they magical or what? They all over the place. So yeah, where my mushroom experts at? Let me know. On top of a mountain somewhere, in the middle of nowhere, where a lot of cows been, on top of the mountains, you find magic mushrooms. See all the newts in the pond. Maybe I'll drink that water. Let's go see the newts. There's a bunch of them in here. Some more newts right there. They're all over the place. So I was coming up here to see.
well. Who knows? All over the place.